So the new gym is about 75 yards from the old gym, AKA the shed. The mechanic, cowboy cam, my buddy Big Boss Man, and Tank for five minutes helped me build this place. Welcome to the Jack and Homeless Shelter. Come on in, let's go. All right, welcome to the new place, the Jack and Homeless Shelter. Here is, uh, I got a nice array of magazines here. I got Girl Next Door, 1985 contest album. That's a good one that came from Pappy. A couple old Iron Man. <laughs> Uh, we got this new dumbbell rack. This new dumbbell rack is badass. Come here, look at it. It's got uh, custom logos on each side. It's got these custom dumbbells made, these 110s. And it's got my logo on the other side. Those are badass. We started up here with the, is it called the Ring of Fame? We started here. It was going to go all wrap all the way around. But. There might be a new place coming soon, aka the new barn. Don't let the cat out of the bag, but the Ring of Fame might be started again. We have to take these down. We've got a lot of pictures to take down if we do decide to go. Here we got this. We got this new sign, the Huffin Barbell Neon Moon. As many of you know, there's a pelican on my logo, and uh, there's a pelican and a lot of shit. The pelican is a fin bird. There's a side story to that. My pappy. Saved a pelican's life back in 1975 at Daytona Beach. He was running the beach. He got drunk as hell the night before, ran the beach, ran the booze off. Him and my uncle saw a pelican in distress. Pelican had a hook in its beak, so he went over there. My uncle grabbed the pelican. My old man grabbed the hook out of its beak, and the pelican took off. And ever since then, the pelican has been the fin bird. So that's why there's pelicans and random shit. Happy put it on all his shit, and I put it on all my shit. So that's the story of the Pelican. We've got a gas heater in here, which is much needed in uh, Illinois. We've got a couple signs up. we got a nice rack here for, for barbells. Actually, we don't have a rack, but all those barbells go in the corner. This is the pride and joy right here. This is the, this is the brother workbench right here. My guy at SOA Welding on Instagram made this state of the art. And it turned out fucking awesome. We put two garage doors on here. So we got, a, we got this garage door, and then we have a garage door on the other side, so we open them both up in the summertime. We got a, a fat drunk guy out in the yard drinking beer. Um, I don't know if you see that or not. He's been here since seven this morning drinking. All right, we have the deadlift platform. Me and uh, the mechanic, AKA Dan Mackey, we built this, painted it. We should have actually made a video on how to do this. It's not very hard, but it took a long time. And then, uh, got my chalk bowl. There's chalk in here, empty beer cans, wrist straps. Huckfinbarbell.com. 20% off right now. Got some ammonia. You wanna try some of this shooter? Here, give it away. It's fucking strong, ain't it? All right, where are we at here? Oh, this is pretty cool. This is, some fan made this for me. We'll find a find it a home in the next place. This is uh, one of my favorite pictures of all time, right here on the wall. This is uh, in the animal cage, competing against a guy named T. Cummings. I think me and him both sailed like 750 or 760. I don't know whatever it was, but yeah, it was one of the best experiences, uh, policing wise I've been a part of for sure. That was wild. I got fucking drunker down in the cage, slamming beers, Ultimate Warriors theme song. He came out to once, Steve Austin's theme song, and then uh, then Hogan, I think, at the end. We just hung our belts up, all these belts here. You know, we're all Pioneer Fit, my guy, Matt, made all these belts for me. This is the original one he made me, the first one he ever made me. All right, this is the, the Rep Fitness Monster Cage. This thing is a fucking beast, it is huge. Uh, this was the first big piece of equipment we had in the, in the shed that barely fit the shed. 
and it was a bitch to get out of the shit. Uh, but yeah, it's got everything. I mean, it's got everything you need here. Rep Fitness set this up to me a couple years ago. Good, good company. But we do a lot of shit on this. And the Rep Fitness bench as well. And welcome to my office here. The desk me and Dan designed. Uh, the mechanic. The mechanic built it. Pops off like this. Bam. Got my desk here. I got my, my beer. I drink beer in here. I look up uh, stuff on Pornhub in here, you know, before the gym to start edging, you know, to get ready to bench, get my testosterone up and shit like that. Uh, right, set it up. Usually this is what I do before I work out. I got Pornhub on here going. Get to ring a fire out here. In here. A little bit of protein popcorn, you know, for a little sugar. This is my little fired up training areas. One of my favorite spots in the gym. And welcome to the saddest part of the new gym. The old bench. There it is. Many great memories on that thing. Now it's just a table. But don't worry guys, it'll be back in action soon. Stay tuned. Shooter, get the fuck out of here. Okay, bye.